Mirza Sahib claimed that Qadian is mentioned with Makkah and Medina in the Quran. Okay. You earlier said that it is not that this exact text is there, but Mirza Ghulam Qadiani is saying no, this exact text is there. Dream is completely when you are sleeping in a deep sleep, and Kashaf is when you are half sleep, half awakened. Why did you use the word hab or dream when it when this word was not there? Why did you do that? I was translating in my own words. Now you are saying that it is not in the Quran and Mirza Ghulam Qadiani say it is in the Quran. Who's right? Who's wrong? How many Quran are there? Quran is only one. Only one. Then Mirza Ghulam Qadiani saw a Quran in the vision. Was that same one Quran or different Quran? How many gods are there? Subhanallah. Ali. Ali bhai, uh, today we are discussing some of the lies as we claim they are lies of Mirza Sahib. Okay, we read some quotes <laughs> from Mirza Sahib. One of the one of the things we are mentioning. Or discussing right now, and we can go straight into it. Then Mirza Sahib claimed that Qadian is mentioned with Makkah and Medina in the Quran, okay, uh, with honor, and it's actually there. And then we presented the full quote where Mirza claims that uh, Ghulam Qadir, uh, his brother, was reading the Quran to him, and then he read these words in the Anzalnahu Qariba Min Al Qadian, which is not in the Quran. Then he said, then Mirza said, it is fil hakikat, it is there. So, do you believe that? <coughs> अच्छा पहले ये जहर मैं सुन चुका हूँ सॉरी आई हैव ऑलरेडी लिसन व्हाट वाज गोइंग ऑन बिफोर आई थिंक इफ वी विल नॉट रिपीट सम ऑफ द थिंग्स एंड देन वी विल जस्ट टॉक अबाउट डायरेक्टली ऑन द ऑन द यूजफुल पॉइंट्स एंड देन ट्राई टू ड्राइव समथिंग बाय टेकिंग इक्वल टाइम नॉट इक्वल टाइम एट लीस्ट you three persons are on one side <laughs> mean on on the side of one one kind of thinking and maybe i'll be agree on some of the points and i'll be disagree on some of the points then i think uh, at least uh, at least uh, a reasonable time should be given to me yeah yeah absolutely go ahead as long as you stick to the topic and give answers yeah. to it uh, yeah, because... i mean you know definitely when i will talk about some point then i'll present my own view maybe okay. we will be agree or not agree okay no problem at, least, uh, at that time let me speak for a reasonable time if you will cut me Then I cannot. Uh, I mean, uh, okay. Uh, present, present what I uh, what I am uh, thinking about. Okay. Ali, before you start, I just have one request. I hope that you will agree with us. We always give you opportunity to speak. Right? Is that right, Ali? Yeah, yeah, right. Okay. Ali. What you have to say on the Qadian in the Quran? Yes. Firstly, do you do you do you believe it's there physically? You no. Know, as long as this word is concerned, this word is not in 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 Quran. Qadian word is not there. Okay, good, good. Now we we're making progress. Good, it's not there. So now it's established the word Qadian is not in the Quran. Okay, brilliant. Right, as long as this word Ka mean. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, we know the word. Don't talk about Alif and Dal, then Ya, then Nun. That's not uh, mean okay. literally. That word is not in Quran. Okay, I, is it there in translation? Another word is used for Qadian. A word, not sentence. A word. One by one. Is That's there is there a mention of Qadian in another word that can be translated as Qadian? No, basically we are coming to that point. Yeah. What Mirza Ghulam Ahmed Qadiani. And uh, I think la in last stream when I was using the word Allah Salam, yes. And then uh, I I think you are being hurt on that word. That's why if it, I use word it, Sahib, then it, you will not be hurt. No, because, because I don't it, want to hurt you then. Yes, yes, correct. Because, yeah, because, because yeah, yeah. So you be that, that 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 I can that can I say I'm in my heart, or I will use the word Sahib. Yeah. Uh, mean I I also take care of your your feelings. Thank you very much because we we don't want to express our feelings. Yeah, yeah, yeah definitely, definitely. I don't because want to hurt, hurt someone's feelings. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, so yeah. it's all fair. that we remain on neutral ground which is very yeah, good yeah. thank you for that we appreciate that yeah, now 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 it's clear that the word qadian is not in the quran we are both yeah. keep it good now mirza sahab here in this quote on the screen is saying that the word qadian not only the word that verse inna anzalnahu fi uh, inna anzalnahu qariban min al qadian okay uh, that we revealed him or it we don't know what what he means by that quran or himself qariban min al qadian uh, that we sent him near qadian and mirza is saying or mirza sahab is saying fil haqeeqat quran sharif me likha hua hai do you believe that do you agree with that fil haqeeqat bit fil haqeeqat means actually reality in reality okay before uh, i start i think i must open the same book then i will have to understand uh, the things that before you know after reading before and after then i think it will be easy for me you 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 say what basically i understood and what uh, the person who has uh, written this willing to say that what he is willing to I mean uh, what he is understanding from these words or what he want to say from these words so i think i i would uh, i would like to understand uh, from the same book then then better i, I will i will uh, i will say according to my understanding about the about this point uh, on which you are talking about okay ali just a quick question do you know this thing before yeah so just tell us that what you used to think before I mean basically 
uh, there are many and such kind of things which uh, are uh, related to revelations on uh, Mirza Sahib. Okay, as long as uh, revelations are concerned, we Ahmadi believe our our belief is that okay, revelations. There are you know three kinds of revelations as mentioned in the Quran. Anyway, that is another discussion. But as as long as the revelations are concerned, they are purely from the God. Okay, if those revelations are from the God, then definitely we 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 cannot uh, negate that. Uh, but with understanding, not not blindly understand. Okay. But it, and if there is a if there is a revelation, so definitely there will be a description uh, before and after. So I will have to. So this uh, is a, that, yeah, according, yeah. according to Mirza. According to Mirza, this is revelation. Yeah, this is revelation. Yes, in the this, is, this is not his own concluded. I mean, and, uh, dry words. This is revelation. And he's, saying, and he's yeah. saying it's in the Quran. He did not say the same words are in the Quran, but no, he felt. No. टाइमिंग phenomenon Basically, that found Basically, you were talking but, on one issue from more than half an hour from the previous guy and you, yeah. and you did not conclude anything from that no 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 because he was playing games he was not giving to that then, I mean, then you will say about me i am playing games you can say yeah, yeah. I mean, he's playing if, games if you cannot read black and white urdu and actually have get get go away with the same understanding as us then you clearly playing because there are three people here we cannot possibly all be liars and deliberately miss it you are not the authenticity or you are not the authorized person which uh, which can be 100% uh, trust <laughs> ali i know uh, look ali look yeah. all we are trying to highlight is just Let few me... minutes before you said that this exact text is not in the quran mirza ghulam qadiani said that ye ilha yahi ilhami ibarat likhi maujood hai that this very revealed text is found uh, is, is, is that say, from, is that from correct no no wait wait, wait ali ali is that translation correct but can i open the book please then but we don't uh, have time we... ali we don't have time half an hour 20 minutes 15 minutes no 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 i will take the same time but you will give but at, at least i must read uh, the, the not much uh, many many yes. how, how much how much do you want to read let me know how much you want at to least, read at least at least a few lines before okay, okay please, please go ahead can yeah. you bring it down can you bring it yeah down? yeah i do it now yes i do it now yeah. no i will i will open the same book please then i can i will i will have to check uh, the headings of that book at least Brother, Ali, i will take your much time i will take your much time i will take the same time what you will give me so at least i will i will say on the basis of uh, some meaning Okay. Yes, Ali, go ahead. Please take your time. Take your time. Tell us. Go ahead. Open the book. Yes, Ali. Ah, uh, you wanted to explain this passage in the light of reading all the other things around this passage. So, Bismillah. Go ahead. How much time I have? One minute. <laughs> One minute is. Uh, give him. Give him two minutes, sir. Uh, in Tehaz, yeah. it's okay. Yeah. Yes. Thank you very much, uh, Sheikh Saif, for for this your favor. Can I now speak? Okay. I give my why my, my one minute <laughs> to you. No problem. <laughs> You yeah, know, no, I really appreciate. I, I, I'm really thankful to you, Sheikh Saheb, <coughs> for your uh, generous uh, behavior, attitude. <laughs> you and me, we agree on that point. That okay, this is a revelation. This was not uh, mean a thing which uh, Mirza Saheb has uh, derived himself. And in his uh, dream or in his revelation, he has seen his uh, brother Qadir. Okay, and Ulam Qadir. Gulam, Gulam Khan. Khan. Yeah, Gulam Khan. He was reading Quran in the revelation, not in actual life. And then in the in the dream, he was reading Quran with the word Qadian. And then in the dream, his Hazrat Mirza Sahab thought that the date this word was actually uh, exist in the Quran. Okay, this is my first point. Now I'll just come to second point. As you know, Hazrat Imam Abu Hanifa, in his dream, he was standing on the Quran in the dream. Okay, you know that. But he was afraid. No, we don't know that. We no, don't know please, that. Please, please. No, let me just come. And then he could not understand ki, why I am standing on the Quran. And then he was collecting the bones of the body of in one of the dream, Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. He was so afraid from that. Then he uh, asked uh, another, uh, mean his uh, in uh, person about the explanation of that dream. 
And the third point, you know, Quran, uh, Allah Ta'ala sometimes, it, this is Hadith Mubarak, and uh, yeah, Allah Ta'ala will say when, you know, uh, in the time of, um, during the time when the person will die, and then Allah will ask him, I was uh, without clothes and you did not give me clothes. I was hungry and you did not uh, uh, give me something to eat. These are the things which need some explanation. And the fourth point, you know, one time Hazrat Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, he said, I smell, I mean, I, I, uh, uh, I felt the smell of God from Yemen, but that was not smell actually from the God. That was basically a person who loved with the Prophet Muhammad So these are the things if, if you will take literally to them, then definitely you will drive. And same thing is being explained here. This was the dream. And this dream has been explained by Hazrat, Hazrat Mirza Ghulam Ahmed Qadiani Sahib. Okay, these words as he has explained in footnote in the previous page. Okay, what I am saying, this is dream. These words are not actually literally exist exist in the Quran. So whenever something is a dream that needs some explanation and he he has mentioned okay, this is tamseel what I what I'm talking about that is tamseel that is exemplary that has relation with other city like Dimashq and I think I have taken more than two minutes and maybe you're not I'm really thankful to that really no problem brother in so the let me ask you yeah. okay let me now, ask there you are, there are many things okay which no, but no I'm concluding within a few seconds okay. Okay. So if you will take them literally so really we cannot reach the conclusion okay. we okay. must think okay, what uh, what he is talking about Mm -hmm. And then what explanation he is giving Mr. Sahib. Okay. And we must uh, build uh, the foundation on the basis of all the revelation which has been revealed to the previous godly persons. Karam, then we can understand oh, these things. Oh. Otherwise, literally, we cannot understand. Thank that. you I mean, so much. Thank you, brother. Thank yeah. you, brother yeah. Ali. Thank yeah. you so yeah. much. Yeah. Yeah. First of all, please clear me one thing. That is there a difference between Roya and Kashif? Hab or Kashif? I think... Uh, uh, mean uh, uh, is this uh, the 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 topic of today's discussion yeah because you yeah. said uh, yeah, ali because you said your first point was because sheikh sahab want to discuss with you your first point because you said six points inshallah i have notes for all of them your first point was that this was a dream mirza gulam kadiani says this was a kashif now we want to understand do you really know what is the difference or do you think are they same khab and kashif because you said it is dream no. or how no 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 mean uh, uh, <clears throat> the dream of uh, uh, prophets is not mm -hmm. the same. Uh, yeah, it's yeah, not the question, Ali. Ali, please no. understand the question. Yeah, don't say whatever the... things. Yeah, please. Yeah, please. Yeah, yeah, Ali, the question is, Ali, the question is, you said that it was a dream. And dream in Urdu, we call either Khab or Roya. There is the word Khab or Roya yeah, in this dream, one. Dream, maybe, you know, I am not a person uh, of that level uh, uh, of English literature. It translates. No, no, uh, no, 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 no. I have English wait, wait. literature. Bola hai nahi hai, Ali sahab. I have put no, no, no. Hai, Roya. This is basically Urdu words. Are, 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 are they no, Roya? Aapne, Ali bhai, you claimed that this is a dream. No, no, you, claimed, you, you claimed, you claimed. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Which word did you read in these this uh, these pages that you are using as dream? No, Which these word? Are basically, revelations. Uh, maybe I revelation is not, something. Re yeah. Revelation is not a dream. Revelations revelation can come. Yes. They can come through a dream, but they're not a dream. Revelations no, themselves but, but are. These, these were the these were the these were the things. So 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 let's come what? to the crux of the matter. Okay. Let's, I mean, Sheikh, Sheikh Saab's question is very important. Okay, yeah. but it's gonna it's gonna prolong the discussion, in my opinion. Yeah, but yeah, uh, I'm uh, I'm asking. Mirza is saying this is ilham. This is wahi. Yes. Do you accept what, that? What he is saying, he is saying this is from God. Yes. So this information, Inna Anzalnahu Kariban Min Al Qadian, is from Allah. Aapne, yes. Whatever you have said, Brother Ali, you based on the dream and the yeah. hab. Dream, yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. You you based all that. But yeah. Mirza Sab has used the word kashaf. The yeah. difference between the khab and kashaf is this: dream is completely when you are sleeping in a deep sleep, and kashaf is when you are half sleep, half awakened. Did Correct. you get it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, if you have read Mirza Sab clearly, when he was in this condition, half awakened, half sleeping, he presented a paper to Allah for the sign. And to sign, Allah have thrown his pen and he got the red drips on his shirt. And when Mirza Sahib is talking about the dream, Roya, about the 
two yellow sheets about Hadrat Isa. They are explaining or interpreting the yellow word into two illnesses. Now, you have to keep it in mind, these things. Here, Mirza Sahib have used the word kashf, that his brother is not in a kashf, kashfi condition. He is not seeing the kashf. Mirza Ghulam Ahmed is saying yep. for yep. himself. Keep it in mind. Yeah, I know that. So if you know, then he is reciting Quran loudly <coughs> in which he used the word Qadiyan. In the Kashaf, yeah. And Mirza Ghulam Ahmed looked at that and he found the word Qadiyan and he said, in reality, I saw just like those, the red ink on his shirt. This condition is half sleeping, half awake. No, on the shirt, the red drops. What are the red, red drops in this? In this, in so this you have not read that. So I, that, I know that. I, why, why, no, you are relating the other things. That no, mean, you related that. Let's stick with the point of why did you use the word hob or dream when it when this word was not there? Dear, why did you do that? Uh, I was uh, translating in my own words, but actually these uh, these the readings uh, are in Urdu. And this is not the question. Ali. The question is. Why did you use the word dream? You you clearly know this much English. I'm sure we all know this much English that dream or harp or roya is something else and kashav is something else. Yeah, but I have not used uh, the same Urdu word. But okay, I must use uh, the word kashav instead. Revelation. Of Re no, no. Revelations are of three kinds according to Quran. But this is a type of revelation, right? Yeah, this is the type of revelation. Okay, then use the word revelation next time in this passage. Don't use the word dream. Number one. Now. Simple question, Ali, is we don't need to beat around the bush. Mirza Ghulam Karyani is saying that according to his revelation, in reality, in the Quran, close to half of the page, this text is found. Is it is this statement correct or not? This statement is correct as long as the revelation is concerned. If this statement is correct, then show us in the Quran. No, I'm talking about as long as the revelation is concerned. That's fine. I accepted your point. What I'm saying is there are two options only. If this revelation of Inna Anzal Nahu Kariba Min Al Qadiyan being found on the page of Quran is, if it is correct, show us in the Quran. No, no, no. Main dreams uh, are revelations. Uh, yes, no dream here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Revelations, uh, mean which are three yeah. kinds of Kashif, or Ilham, or Wahi. They need explanation sometimes. Yeah. Same. I will let I you explain. No. The first point Mirza Ghulam Qadiyani is making that this text is found in the Quran. It is clearly that in the after that you can explain that. First of all, you need to acknowledge either you show us in the Quran or you need to acknowledge that this statement is wrong. It's not in the Quran. You don't have third option. Okay. Do you know I am? I, I don't know anything. Know. Let's take the point, please. Oh, please. Point. I'm coming to that point. Let me please ask something from you as well. I will. I will let you ask any question. But first, let's. Please answer my question. Now, look. if this is in no, look, Mirza Ghulam Qadiyani is saying that Inna Anzalnahu Kariba Min Al Qadiyan is in the Quran. If it is in the Quran, show us. If you and, can't and show, at least at least saying, you need to acknowledge it is in the Quran. And he's saying this, this is uh, this, this is, is not in the Quran. Yeah. Yeah. Saying, this is not in the Quran. Okay. Okay, wait, wait. Okay. Now you are saying that it is not in the Quran, and Mirza Ghulam Qadiyani say it is in the Quran. Who's right? Who's wrong? But he is saying. What was in the revelation? He is saying that this revelation no, no, is in the Quran. No, it does by one second. Yeah, it does by one second. <laughs> Let me break it down. Let me break it down. Yeah. Mirza has a vision, kash, yeah. or revelation, call it what you like. Yeah. Mirza has a kash, vision, revelation, call it what you like. That these words are in the Quran. In the, in the, in the vision. Uh, yeah, in the vision. In the vision, which is from God, right? This vision is from God, right? Ali, why? Is this vision from God? It is from God. The vision tells him that these words are in the Quran. In reality, Mirza is saying this is a kash. We all agree that it's a kash. Mirza has written it. It's a kash. Okay. Kash is a revelation. You've already admitted. So this is a revelation from God as per your claim. Because Mirza was a prophet of God to you. Mirza's God reveals to him that this statement is in the Quran. Okay. So if Mirza is a true prophet of God, receiving true revelations, you need to show us this statement in the Quran. Now. Yeah. And uh, Ali, Ali, just one second, please, please. Look, Ali, the very simple point is what Mirza Ghulam Qadiani was seeing in his vision or Kashif was that true Quran or a false Quran? Because Mirza Ghulam Qadiani, listen, Mirza, Ali, listen, please. Mirza Ghulam Qadiani is see, seeing a Quran in his Kashif, and in this Quran, 
This inna anzalna hu kareeb min al kadian is found. Now Ali, I'm sure that you agree with me. There's only one Quran. Either you see in the kashif, in the dream, or whatever. A prophet cannot claim to have two Quran. So Mr. Ghulam Kadiani is saying that in the Quran, this te this text is found. Inna anzalna hu kareeb min al kadian. So when Mr. Ghulam Kadiani saw that Quran in the kashif, was that a true Quran or a false Quran? Uh... First, uh, you tell me he has seen uh, in his vision uh, his brother Ghulam Qadir. Okay. Sorry. The Mirza Sahib has seen in his vision his uh, elder brother. Have you Mirza. answered my question, Ali? I'm coming. Uh, if, here. If, if, if you are sincere, here. wait, Ali. Wait, wait. If you are sincere, I will let you ask any question. I promise to you. But first, you need to answer my question. How yeah, many Quran are there? I'm coming. Okay, okay. okay. How, how many Quran are there? Wait, Ali, wait, wait, wait. How many Quran are there? Let me build the ground, my dear. I, I will let you build. How many Quran are there? Quran is only one. Only one. When Mirza Ghulam Kadiani saw a Quran in the vision, was that same one Quran or different Quran? How many gods are there? Subhanallah. Ali, can you please answer the question? No, you said there's only one Quran. Ali, wait, Ali, wait. Ali, no, Ali, look, no need to be emotional you said there's only one quran and mirza gulam kadiani is seeing a quran in his kashif and in that quran there is a verse inna anzalnahu kareeb min al kadian now you agree with me either you see in a kashif or in re in real life whatever there's only one quran now you are trying to hide behind the word kashif or whatever My, okay. it's only one quran it's only one quran is this is this line found in the quran these lines are not found in the Quran. In the and why Mirza Ghulam Kadiani said they are found in the Quran? No, I'll, can I explain that? Yes, please. How many times? How much time you are giving me? One Ali, minute? please answer the question. Okay, one minute. Can I have one minute? Please, go ahead. Yeah, at least I must complete my statement. I have time. Okay, I, your, your time start now. Please go ahead. That's good. <clears throat> Mirza Sahib has seen his elder brother Qadr in the dream, but actually he was not his elder brother his name Qadr, Ghulam Qadr, and he has uh, in Tamsil related his uh, his uh, his uh, brother to Qadr Mutlaq, God. I mean, basically, he was Qadr Mutlaq, which he has explained there. Not his brother, but he was God. And God was reading the Quran. He has explained there. Allah. I mean, even his brother was oh, not. Oh, by John, oh, by John, Ghulam Qadir or Qadir me up, Al Qadir me for me up. He has explained, my dear. No, 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 wait, wait, wait. This is, so is, Mirza call, is Mirza calling God Ghulam Qadir? No, 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 no. Hmm. The explanation of the vision. Listen, listen, the more you will dig. The deeper you'll you go, cut me, uh, and, you and, the, me, uh, and the more difficult it will be. You're just not saying... let him speak for one minute. Let him okay. Speak. Okay, okay, please go ahead. Okay, okay. Ali, go ahead. Go ahead. In the previous page, the completely and in very easy word he has explained what I am saying is not literal. That is Tamsil. He has related Kadian to Dimishik. He has related his brother to God, Kadir Mutlak. And he has related this Quran that was in the dream. That was not the real Quran. He has given some oh, seal to that. And I have given him an example. When Abu Hanifa, Imam Abu Hanifa -Islam, was collecting the boons of Holy Prophet -Islam, that you cannot take literal, my dear. If you will take them literal, that's why these many, many Oliyas who are who was uh, mean seen visions and Ali, you don't need to defend all your point is finished this, let me, let this me is not relevant to this one check one minute check one minute okay, Ali, to this. Ali, Ali, look, Ali, look, Ali, Ali look you made your point and now the answer you have given to us subhanallah you said that the quran mirza gulam ka Look, look, you said that the Quran was being recited by Al Qadir, Allah, and Subhanallah, and then you said, but that was not the real Quran. My what do you mean by dear, that? My dear, is, is that the real Quran? When how Amar many Quran are? Oh, bhai, how many Quran are there? No, when Hazrat Amar. Oh, bhai, wait, how many Quran are there? One. Okay, when Allah, according to you, when Allah was reciting the Quran, was that true Quran or false Quran? My dear, that was in oh, bhai, when Allah was reciting the Quran, was that true Quran or a false Quran? Okay, now when Hazrat Imam Abu Hanifa when Allah was, was reciting Ali, no, no, Ali, no, it's enough. In the dream, when Allah was look, you said Allah was the one, not Hulam Qadir, Al Qadir was reciting the Quran. And previously, you admitted that is only one Quran. So, when Allah was reciting the Quran, when Al Qadir was reciting the Quran, was that a true Quran or a false Quran? I have one question from you. No, first answer my question. 
When Al Kabir was reciting the Quran, was that true Quran or false Quran? My simple answer is vision is. When Al Kabir was reciting the Quran, was that true Quran or false Quran? But the things were true. When Al Kabir was reciting Quran, was it true Quran or false Quran? My dear, why you are uh, just no, no. Uh, Ali, wait, Ali, wait, please respect our time as well. Ali, wait, please answer the question. When Al Kabir was reciting the Quran, was that true Quran or false? First, you gave me answer. Mike. Then I will answer. Do you want to answer? You want to go? No. Main one question I have. When Al Qadir was reciting the Quran, was that true or false Quran? You are not. When Al Qadir was reciting the Quran, was that true or false? Okay, you gave me gave me answer of one my question. When Al Qadir was reciting the Quran, was it true Quran or false Quran? One Quran. That when Al Qadir was reciting Quran, was that true Quran or false Quran? That the things were true, but that was in vision. So you said that it was true Quran, right? No, no, the Quran in vision. Why? If you see Quran in vision, is that true Quran or false Quran? In explanation, both are true. If you see Quran in vision, is it the true Quran or false Quran? Literally, the two are different, but in explanation, both are same. How many Quran are there? Quran is one. Okay, so when when Al Qadir was reciting Quran. He was reciting that same one Quran, right? You are making vision with Ali. Religion. There is only one Quran. There is only one Quran. You know that. And when Al Qadir was reciting that. Quran, was Al Qadir reciting that same one Quran or not? My Why you hesitant, Ali? Why you hesitant, Ali? I am not hesitating. I am not hesitating. So just simply say there is why only you, one Quran my, and true Quran. My dear, why you are not sometimes giving answer which is related to this question? Ali, and bhai, you, know, you believe? No, question, no, you Ali. Believe when answer. when Al Qadir was reciting the Quran, Ali, simple question. When Al Qad, you said there is only one Quran. My simple question is when Al Qadir was reciting the Quran, was Al Qadir reciting that same one Quran or not? I told you, my dear, many times. That both Qurans literally were not same. You said that you look to face, wait, wait. You said there's only one Quran. One no, you said both. Quran. You're saying both Quran. No, no. You just there said both Quran. There are one Quran, but there are many, many explanation about that. Oh, boy, I am asking you the Quran which Allah was reciting. Was that same one true Quran or not? Literally not. So Allah was reciting a different Quran. A metaphorical as Quran. No, as long as as long as as long as it was a, as as a metaphorical meaning, Quran. As long as meaning and explanation is Ali, 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 how many Quran are there? One. Okay, when Al Qadir was reciting Quran, was Al Qadir reciting same one true Quran or not? No. How many Quran are there? One. Okay, when Al Qadir was reciting Quran, which Quran Al Qadir was reciting? As long as explanation is concerned. Which Quran Al Qadir was reciting? Not reciting. Ali, Ali, wait, wait, wait. No, look, uh, enough, enough of this. Wait, wait, wait. Ali, bhai, it's time for you. It's time for you to accept. You are wasting much time. No, 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 Ali, bhai, can you? It's time for you to admit and accept that you are upon kufr deliberately. वो कहते हैं ना कि खुद जान बूझ के कुफर करना जान बूझ के नोइंग कर ठीक है ब्रदर ब्रदर वेट Ali, 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 bhai. Yes, yes. It is clear now. To everyone listening and watching, that you are deliberately that guy came and he left the stream as soon as he realized that he doesn't have answers. He just went quiet, left the stream. Now you're giving, you're not giving answers to straight questions. There is only one Quran. We all know that, okay? And in that Quran, these words are not there. So Mirza is claiming from a revelation that these words are there and they're not there, even if it's a vision. So in 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 his vision, Mirza is receiving a new Quran, or Mirza is receiving an addition to the Quran. At least admit that much, okay? Do you accept that Mirza, in his vision, his revelation, received an additional verse to the Quran? Yes or no? Uh, Adran Bhai, now uh, I think if you will give an answer of my question first, so then uh, the answer of uh, my okay, question go, will be. Okay, go ahead. What's your question? Yeah, will be will be come in the answer. Uh, okay, what's your question? Yeah, what's your question? Very question quickly. That, yeah. Uh, there was uh, a vision. And uh, that vision is being related to Imam Abu Hanifa. Okay, I'll Imam Abu there. Hanifa. I'll, I'll deal with you. And he Imam, was, uh, Imam Abu in, Hanifa. In Imam Abu Hanifa is not source of our religion. Imam Abu Hanifa was one of the imams. Uh, with the, okay, Imam Abu Hanifa was one of the imams. No, 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 no. He no, is no, not. No, 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 no. Wait, wait. Mirza Ghulam Ahmed Qadiani is a prophet to you. Imam Abu Hanifa is not a prophet to us. Adnan, we can reject. Ask him this, Adnan, by yeah, asking yeah, this question, so, so don't, don't go there. We are not Adnan, related Adnan, personalities. Imam Abu Hanifa. Ali, we are not Adnan. relating personalities. We are relating. Ali, wait. You all wait, please. Is did Imam Abu Hanifa receive revelation? Did he? Yes. Good question. Tell us. 
that vision then that imam abu hanifa is yeah, it's, a, it's a waste of time it's a waste of time because in tas bhai it's a waste of time maybe we can get take someone else in ali bhai thank you so much for joining us so uh, ali before you go is... before you go ali you are all banking at one point of abu hanifa and you know very well imam abu hanifa did not receive revelation mirza gulam qadiani received revelation these yes. two things are different we don't believe imam abu hanifa to be a prophet we don't you want to go ali or if you want to because you said that you want to say something before going i only I even, though, even though even though you have been very dishonest listen listen today you have been very dishonest i have to say this okay i let you speak still no problem now definitely you will take another person then uh, in the last uh, i mean uh, a couple, not a couple of minutes maybe in last seconds i would just conclude uh, uh, on that point yeah, my dear visions always need explanation briefly speaking okay uh, thank you very much okay thank okay you. thank you so much but to take my one word vision then let of me the one prophet let vision me go after ali ali, ali bhai yeah. please vision of the prophet is always true yeah. keep it in mind yeah, yeah. it's revelation it's a revelation i trust you no it does not uh, the explanation <laughs> now if you will explain and he will z will abc will different doesn't make sense to in a sense literal sense or uh, need explanation uh, i think it's enough for today no no we are not we don't want to continue for the, allah, yeah. for the sake of allah for the sake of allah just remember one thing either you recite either a prophet recite in a vision or kashaf or reality there is only one quran and in that one quran this verse is not found case no, is simple simple very simple no for them it's not simple no no it's for them yeah, yeah for them. of course enough yeah. for them for, course, for them for them it's, it's they've been exposed to this kufr for the first time in their lives they've never been challenged like this before they don't know what to do okay they're trying to be clever they're trying to spin uh, they want they to make, play on both sides yeah yeah they are they are trying to make excuses for a very difficult person to defend so we have to be we have to be patient i we request from all the audience to be patient because i know people get frustrated by repeated questioning and mm. repeated answers same answers same questions we are doing this exercise to show you yeah. that these people many of them they don't want to believe they know it's kufr they know it's bakwas they know it's gibberish it's rubbish okay they still want to defend it but there are those who want to believe and there are those who are coming to accept islam there are those who are coming to actually reject islam mm. so let it be we're not going to guide everyone we're not going to convince everyone if rasulullah prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam the most sincere man to walk the planet okay uh, could not convince everyone in his own family who mm. the hell are we who are we right exactly. we can only we can only try we can only yeah. try to yeah. show 